Welcome back to another YouTube video and today I'm going to be showing you guys a slightly different strategy. Um, this is more so for free content. If you guys are trying to build a website on a budget, this is a really good video to follow. Um, few things that are required, you will need ChatGPT4 um, and also the premium version. Um, if you guys can find a YouTuber that has got a lot of videos um, on their channel on a specific subject, that's also uh, required. And yeah, those are the only two things that are required. I'm going to be showing you a few different features that you guys can obviously do um, that will obviously make this more of a bulletproof SEO strategy. So first of all, what we're going to do is we're going to go over to Jackie Chow's channel. I'm not gonna. I've just randomly picked um, Jackie Chow's channel. It could be literally anyone, right? So if you guys are looking for, for example, if you guys are looking to start up an affiliate website to do with travel hacks, you might say, you might search for um, a travel blogger, um, and you can essentially find um, some guys like that. So for example, what I might do here. Is I'll duplicate this channel, I'll pause this video, travel, um, blogger, right, let's just find somebody that has been to a lot of um, different travel vlogger, should I say, um, find somebody that's been to a few different countries, so for example, we might use Call Me Chris, um, see where she has been, does she only do travel? No, she doesn't. Um, I took a gap here to travel. Do, 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 do. Let's do Hey Nadine. So, yeah, these guys have got a lot of travel hack related videos. So, for example, how to book cheap hotels, cruising with a toddler, what you need to know, the best drone um, for traveling, what to pack for a cruise, etc., etc. A lot of really good content on their YouTube channel, right? So back to our example of Jackie Chow. Um, if you guys haven't, make sure to subscribe to him. I'm just using this as an example. But he has recently done a video series. Um, I say recently, February 5th, and um, he started doing it. He's talking about like all sorts of link building, um, foundational links, PBNs, etc., etc. But what I have done is I have downloaded the video captions um, plugin. So if we go here, um, video, video captions, as you can see here, it's completely free to use and we have just got it enabled, right? And the prompt that I gave it was, can you watch this video and turn it into an SEO optimized blog? And if we take a look here, um, he's talking about like building your own free backlinks, he's talking about foundational links, um, guest posts, etc, etc. And basically this is the article that has come back with, the ultimate guide to building your own backlinks starting with foundational links and obviously he's talking about foundational links um, in this video. So what are foundational links? Foundational links are essentially the base layer of your website's backlink profile, they are typically Easy to, easy to acquire and cost effective, often free. Obviously mentions free here. Um, why are foundational links important? They are helping build trust, credibility, visibility, diversity. Does he actually mention that? Um, deep dive into foundational links. Recommendations for foundational link services. No, it doesn't. Um, how to build foundational links. So local citations and directories, social media profiles, search engine sort of submissions, high uh, debate authority profiles, utilize SEO tools and services. Now, <clears throat> and you've obviously got the conclusion there as well. Now, one thing that I would, you always do as well, is you can run this through perplexity as well to essentially expand on each of these subheadings. So what we're going to do now is we're going to head over to perplexity. Um, now, this is an optional, um, this is optional, you don't need to do this. But if you do, you're, you're going to want to use a prompt like, can you expand on this uh, blog article? for my website, just 
paste that in and click on, you don't need Copilot for this, click on go and this is going to go and do its thing now. So you've got the H1 there, wire foundation, wire foundational links important, um, so on and so forth. Backlinks are a vital aspect of your um, any SEO success, successful SEO strategy and so on and so forth. So that's the article there. We can also generate an image. So if we have got, for example, painting, um, we'll see what comes back. Sometimes this is a bit hit and miss. Sometimes it's a little bit better. Yeah, I don't know why. It keeps generating an image of a, so, a trees. Um, let's do generate image again. We'll give it illustration. We'll see if it's any better. Um, but that the perplexity.ai, the reason why I like this so much is that it always um, looks to break up the different um, sentences. So you obviously got that benefit. Um, one thing that I would also do as well with this specific video is local citations and directories. I would probably create an individual page for that. Social media profiles, I would create an individual page for that. So like, I would do like the benefits of local citations and directories, the benefits of social media profiles for your for your SEO campaign, etc., etc. So you've got different um, variations there. The images, I'm not gonna lie, they're not that great. Um, some of these images, um, they have essentially went and searched Google Images and got these. But yeah, I'm, I'm not a fan of these images at all. Uh, one thing you could do when it comes to uh, the images is if we do generate image again, let's do diagram. Um, there is one way of creating a little bit more um, of a unique image that does work. Um, again, it is a little bit more of a time lengthy process. But if we open this up, if we save this, and if we go over to canva.com, we can just click and drag this. And if we go over to view the file, click on edit photo, using design. <clears throat> so you can obviously do edit photo here and use the grab text tool. Um, sometimes this works, sometimes it doesn't. It's a bit of a mix and match um, has it worked here it's worked for this title here um, but for a lot of these you would need to just go in and essentially manually edit it so you would need to like do white on white there another um, strategy that you could do as well is if you did want to um, create a more of a unique image canva does have a infographic so infographic um, Canva so you can create an infographic this way as well it's a little bit of a easier process but you do need to obviously give it the information so if you did want to create the top 13 links that you need to acquire in 2024 you would need to essentially just swap out all of these icons swap out the text and then you have got a unique image there so that has also one other thing as well. The reason why I said at the start of the video we would want to be taking a look at a blogging web or a blog, sorry, a vlogging YouTuber that only specifies on one subject as well is because you get a lot of blog ideas, right? So how to book cheap flights? Yeah, well everyone everyone knows that if you're setting up a travel blog, you're probably going to write that. But for example, flying with a toddler on lap, right? There's there's a hundred and one different questions that you need to essentially or you could answer with a blog on that. So can you travel with a toddler on your lap? Um, do they charge you extra to travel with a toddler on your lap? These are all questions to do with this video. And if you were to convert that video into a blog article using the method that we've just spoke about today, you can obviously answer all of those questions there. Um, 100 travel um, hacks that could be like a pillar po post or a link bait post some people call it um, and again this could acquire, uh, get you a lot of links as well 
um, doing that sort of uh, type of blog. So that has been my video on free AI content. Now, would I recommend this strategy for everyone? This is more of a cheaper strategy. Um, it will take a little bit more time as opposed to just going to autoblogging.ai and generating a load of articles. This is a little bit more of a manual process. Um, but if you guys do have tighter budgets, definitely check this article or check this out and let me know your process and if it does work. Um, and yeah, that has been my video on free AI content. I say free. Uh, if you guys do have any questions, feel free to drop them down below. And if you guys want a free 15-minute strategy call for your website, make sure to check out casualdash.com. Thanks.